Well, Texas A&M baseball and Rob Childress has a history of churning out high caliber arms. Seven Aggies played in the major leagues last year and six of them were pitchers. So it should not come as a surprise that even though they lost a second round draft pick in John Doxakis last year, they have another frontline guy right behind him in Asa Lacey, but he's far from alone. Ace is a machine, of, we call him a robot because he just keeps working. And you got guys like Christian Rowe have been putting a lot of work in and Chandler Joswalk. We're going to be deep, and I'm, I'm really confident in our pitching staff. In his two years in Aggieland, AM pitcher Asa Lacey owns an 11 and 5 career record with a 2 3 2 ERA, striking out 178 batters along the way. Strikeout number six. Yeah, I mean, same routine. Uh, mindset changed a little bit. Got to be a little more efficient than we were last year, get the team, uh, you know, get deeper into the game. With stats like that, he enters the 2020 season as the odds-on favorite to be the staff's ace pitcher. It's always a good feeling knowing who your Friday night guy has a chance to be before the season starts. There's been years that we didn't know and we weren't going to know until we got through these three weeks. And while the preseason All-America honors roll in, Lacey stays zoned in to the task at hand. I try to stay off my social media as much. I'm not very actively involved with that kind of stuff, but it, it's cool. But in, in the sense, um, you know, my eyes are here with Texas A&M. But even the best ace is only worth one game per weekend, and Lacey knows he has the guys behind him in the rotation and the bullpen to go toe to toe with some of the best staffs in the conference and in turn the country. Since it's just kind of just continuing to be a good teammate and and look always look outward, just always supporting your staff and supporting your your hitters. Just had great leadership out of our pitching staff. When you think about Asa Lacey. Christian Roa, uh, Chandler Jaswalk, those guys have been amazing leaders and they lead from the front. But when you need to set the tone for a series on Friday night, it's always good to have an Asa in the hole. You know, certainly taking our Saturday guy last year, Asa Lason, moving him up uh, to Friday, that's a good feeling.